Well, let's go and report some stuff, shall we? If I don't hit the wrong button. I'm not going to report the uh, main plotline quest just yet, unless it forces me to. So I want to see how I'm getting on with um, the other quests. Is it you? Hey guys, welcome back! Did you take your photo? Sure did. But first, let me turn your camera. Thanks! And now, it's off we go. Oh, uh, what? Where are we going? The Orbital Factory, of course. Got to develop a photo, of course, if we decide to see a picture. Ah, true. I'm right behind you. Phew, all done here. Yeah, thanks. Now then, how did the photo turn out? Yeah, it's okay. Use the material more or less. Would you like to take a look? Yeah, absolutely. Ah, thank you, Ados. It's not nice one I thought it would be. The angles are pretty though. This is a research material photo. If possible, I'd like to prefer the straight on photo. Of course. I got kind of worked up and excited and tried to take it at a different angle. That finishes the job, Ben. Right. Thank you so much for all you've done. Climbing all the way to a tower must have been exhausting. It's kind of rough, but. It's all part of my job, don't worry about it. Ah, thanks. How you can say that makes me relieved. Right, it's it, not much, but. Hey, take this. Moon glasses. Piece of equipment I picked up research funds. Sure, will be useful if you have to venture into dangerous places. Thanks. Since you're offering, we'll accept. Thanks, appreciate it. No, no, it's not all that much. Anyway, if you pardon me. Thanks again for your work. Good luck. I'm kind of curious, too, honestly. It's going to be quite a piece of homework, certainly. Well, I'll do my best to live up to your expectations. See you guys later. Yeah. Okay, so what's that new item we've got? Um, equipment. It's got to be a... Um, with poison and blind. Okay. I'm oh, doing in health anyway. Um, I'm full, so that's fine. I'm now going to go up to the um, town up top. And, um... Hand in more foods if I can. Navigating using a map as usual. I've been through there. because I've fought those monsters. Let's see how we're doing on my food quest. I should be in this angle, to be honest. I think it's this upstairs, isn't it? This one? Oh, did you find something? Oh! This ingredient was on the list. Juicy bone. Curative horn, tender poultry, bird egg. Goodness, looks like you found quite a bit out there. This is nearly complete. You've done excellent work. Guess this means the job's complete? I suppose, still. Oh, why not? Any chance you're up for going a little while longer? Asking if you'd like to see that this is completed. I have a feeling there's still a few more ingredients out there that haven't been found. If you can find them more, I'll offer you a nice little bonus. How about it? What do you say? I'm trying to think if there's any places I'm... I'll end it here. You've got other jobs I need doing. Quite well, disappointing, like you call it with passion. I won't push the issue further. Consider it complete. You've done some fine work. I'm sure to let you know if I've got any other jobs. Good luck. 
be honest, that one's more of a pain on the ass than anything else because it involves loads of wandering around and backtracking. It. Which is not my idea of fun, to be honest. Well, sometimes it is, but not today. Today I want to just hang on with the plot line and... Slightly out of place, but I don't care. So I'm back in town now. If I remember my uh, quest right, I can get my quest open. I've only got the um, white shadow case and those two to hand in, which is fine by me. Things like this, I get so confused with every place. Hey! Hey, you're back! Estelle, hello! Neil, Duff, Dorothy, what are you two doing in Ruan? Obviously, getting some pictures taken and articles made with freaking wildfire and election. And then I heard something weird beyond that happening. So I stopped by to check out what's up. Isn't it weird? What do you mean this white shadow thing? Actually, while you're out, we had another report of a thing appeared in the city limits. The citizens are starting to get frightened and demand answers. The hell, this has become a real problem. And to cap it off, oh, the picture of a young lady took. This one pretty much puts an hour on coffin. A picture? You mean... So what, so you're into ghost hunting now? No, it's nothing like that really. We're just taking pictures of a hotel at night and it's a bush ghost picture. Here, take a look. What? Yeah, I'd call this decisive. Hey, come on, guys. Don't you think this is a bit too hasty? It might be a, a, a malfunction of a, of a camera. Yeah. No, I don't think it's a camera's fault. It's a shiny, brand new model from a central factory. I'm taking a real good care of it. It's a malfunction, okay? Malfunction. It's tell you're scary of a sudden. Anyway, I'm willing to put a lot more faith in these sightings now. It seems something really is out there. More to a point, I think working with a medium on this wouldn't be a bad idea. Let's all share information to start with. Did you get statements from witnesses? Yeah, we checked all three. Oh crap, it's an emergency. Help! Hey, what's wrong? Why is it worked up? Is it robbery? No, no. Supporters of Norman Porters are arguing. They're facing one another on Lan Langyard Bridge. What fuss over an argument? Hold up, those are mayoral candidates, right? Friggin'. Oh, it sounds like an article. Maybe a riot. Die for you, we won! Aye, aye, sir! So later, Estelle. Ah, oh, they're fast. We should get moving too. If that thing turns into a damn ride, we need to be on hand. Right. Thank you, too. Good luck. Meanwhile, I'm going to report stuff. Uh, no new stuff. You aren't fooling anyone. We know you're behind the ghost that appeared at the hotel. No one's son is better than from a shock. Have you no shame? What disgusting tricks won't you stoop to? Oh please, that son is a member of Ravens. How do you expect to trust something of work as fuck says? Wait a moment. Criticize me as a wish, but only a coward would attack my family. You will attract your statement, put on my son a thug. Uh, that was probably a little much there. But sir, why are you agreeing? Because you've been on issues like this, the tourism party dares to try, try such tactics. Who's daring to try things? The harbour party is the one crossing a line. You really think your harassment with this ghost trick will really stop us? Let's really, really get out of hand. Should we step in? We ain't throwing punches yet, so stay cool. Get in a good position, bro. Let's just get real. We need to be in a right, ready to jump in. 
There's so many spectators, we can't get closer. How the heck did Neil manage to get up the front so early? I can't take this anymore! You limp wristed toy suckers think you can beat us in a straight fight! Oh, that's it, let's do it. The employees of Norman form will hold, uphold Norman's honour. Stop, all of you! Do not sink to the level of thuggery! Everyone, calm down. We should discuss this rationally. Oh crap. Son of a. Can't stop being to come now. My goodness, what a tragedy we're making. I know that voice. Violence creates nothing. It only opens empty chasms between men. To you, I offer this song. A gentle, sad song to encourage you to overcome that which divides your hearts and joins us hands as one. The sun shines. A rainbow bridge. I cross it to reach you. And yet, as I search, it fades into the sky. Dancing with loneliness and the wind. If this wish is doomed to fade, without ever coming true, then may it leave at least a scar. My first promise? A promise I cannot keep. I keep your breath encased in amber, sitting within this eternal dream. Ah, it seems you are all touched by my song. Remember, there is but one truth. Love is eternal. Ahem. Well, Portos, I think now would be a good idea for both of us to call our heads a bit. I agree. Besides, we're, um, we're obstructing traffic, yes. Back to harbour, everyone. Yeah. Why have we got flies in this route? And the fleeing begins. Can't blame them. Ah, but the citizens here are as is dead to both action as rest as anywhere else. Now what truly really moves them is the miraculous power of my melody. You rare reporters, take photos and write articles to your heart's content over this day's miracle. Okay, here we go. Say cheese. Hmm, marvellous. Uh, right. You guys still in the mood to talk about that stuff you mentioned before? Sure. I feel like we forget if we don't report it soon anyway. Let's get back to a guild and have some report to John. Hmm? Oh, Estelle! To where are you going? No, wait, please, wait! Oh, what a great expression. How heartbroken. It's so cute. <laughs> How thick we can be, my Rose. To meet your fated partner again after such a long absence, and then to abandon him. What cruel barbs you cast. <laughs> fated partner. My left Drager. Whatever god is his name you're doing in Ruan anyway, Olivier? Aren't you supposed to be turning into a prune of Elmo's hot spring? Mula contacted me with a maple leaf then, you see. He was kind enough to tell me you had returned from your travails, Estelle. And I thought to myself, she has deprived of my person for so long. Her happiness is imperiled. I must welcome her back. And I flew here post haste. It certainly feels in peril now. Still, I haven't seen you since the Queen's birthday celebrations. Thanks for your help back there, Olivier. It's nice to see it is nice to see you again. Truly? Ah yes, but your honesty makes it difficult for me to stay focused. We didn't take the opening to make a joke at my expense, it leaves me wanting to think more. Let's see you deliver another line like that through broken teeth. Whatever. Jean, this thing is Olivier, one of the people who helped us join the coup. He's a musician from Abibonia, we think. 
Ah, nice to meet you. You seem like an interesting person. So I'm guessing you don't mind if we let him in on this then? Normally I want to kick him out on his butt for being an outsider. I doubt he ever listened though. Just try not to make eye contact, he'll go it maybe I'll go away. Oh, oh a gate. Truly you are immediately acquainted with my ways. Hey, stop trying to imply things. We'll never even talk much. We have just fought on the same side for a while. Anyway, going beyond that. Yes, that sounds like a good idea. Seriously, we have a story to talk about here. We don't have all day either. Dorothy and I need to get a scoop on the election. Right, I get it. This is what I witness that to say. I see, so you managed to gather a lot of detailed information. It's enough to see that something definitely is up at least. Really? I thought library was kind of vague. Well, the possibility of being a prank from a male candidate to cause one of the problem is out of for one. Scaring Norman's kid is one thing. I kind of doubt we'd waste time scaring garden orphans. Also, one of his ghosts can fly. That was consistent across every report. That's not something Joe Average can pull off. Well, but it must be a real ghost. Maybe it was Andrew Noble went crazy. I was locked up in a lonely cell. I forced to wear a mask forever. Then after hundreds of years, he was alive as a spooky ghoul. Please stop talking about such scary ideas or a happy face, thanks. Besides, ghosts are supposed to be bound to people or places. So it can't be a ghost, can it? Not necessarily. What do you mean, Olivier? You know, just think. Well, I can't wait on a matter of our fugitive ghostliness. However, Sal's support features several common points. From what she said, I actually think it's quite possible our spectre is bound to a place or person. Oh, you're shocked on a thought. I was about to say the same thing, actually. Indeed. As a wandering hunter of love, I must keep a map of Libelle handy at all times. Let's use my map to look at Estelle's sightings from a geographical perspective. <laughs> Here we are. Now then, Estelle, you investigated three areas, believe. Here, here and here, correct? That's right. The Ruan District, Ellerton, and Mercia Orphanage. If you look over the for for different... One particular point stands out. Estelle, I don't suppose you see it yourself now, looking at the map. The point was obviously different with all your testimonies. How would that be? Where it went? Precisely. Our raven feathered tough man in the city of block said it went northeast. Alice in Guardsman said it went north. And our young orphan said the white shadow went east. What? Now I get it. Never would have figured. That's pretty conclusive, yeah? It looked like that. Not many other places it could come from, really. Exactly my point. Yenis Royal Academy, it must be around there. Olivia, you're pretty clever. Okay, I don't care if it's a ghost or whatever. We're gonna go out to the Academy to find out just what it is. Jean, is it cool, yeah? Absolutely, I'll phone ahead. Go on over and investigate, see if you can get to a bottom of this. I'd have to wonder if our reporter friends have any plans, however. I can't really afford to cut out, cut out on the election. Okay, Dorothy, I'll leave this in your hands. Yes, sir. I'll do some real ghost hunting. Get tons of pictures. No! Help solve a damn mystery. You follow Estelle, take pictures relating to a ghost mess. Oh, okay. Don't really get it, but I'll do my best. We didn't actually agree to this part. Now, now. But he did get us that photograph, so let's have him out in return, okay? Right, fine. The camera girl can come too. Ah, I kind of feel like this is... Leads away any seriousness the situation might have. Still, Darfy probably can help us out, so... That's settled then. I'm counting on you guys. But excuse me, I have a couple of male candidates to interview. Oh, before that, though, Estelle. Your dad told me a little bit about the Joshua thing. Not a lot, but enough for me to get a picture. I know you're worried about those people. If you hear anything might be related, I'll look I thought it's with Guild. Um So yeah, keep yourself up a lip or something. Anyway, you gotta go. Neil. Ah, Neil's embarrassed. It was a really big shock when he heard about it from Cassius, I think. I think he's really been looking away to help you. Really? If only he could be a little more honest though, it'd be sweet. But make sure to contact the guild too for taking him need to have pictures of weird people. Just still fight on, yeah, or something. Anyway, thanks, Arthur. After World Academy. Like I said, I'll call ahead and let him know to let you in. Good luck.
I don't even know why I'm bothering to ask at this point, but I suppose you want to come to Olivier? Oh, my dear Stell, you may as well ask a finch where my birds fly. After all, I abandoned my warm, moist embrace of Elmo to come here. Figures, huh? Okay, what do you think? Should he come? Whatever, I don't care that much. Let's get one thing straight, though. I don't really trust you, pal. If you do anything strange, I'll wreck you. Clear? Ah, such hostility, such negativity, what a pity. Sometimes a wild type like you isn't bad either, you know. What? Ah, but fear not. I shall refrain from pouring my effect into your untamed vessel until after I've earned your trust. Screw it! How about I wreck you right now, then? I think it feels really adult here. Is it, is it exciting? Uh, time to start locking your door again, at a gate. Okay, looks like we got a gate in my party again, and we got a uh, friend, the um, Kai Galong. So, join me next time when I go to the academy, and hopefully I'll, I'll meet somebody um, with a um, ghost or something else which is uh, capable of flight. Bye-bye. Uh.